How often have you had to replace a bat because it broke or cracked? Well, say goodbye to those frustrations with the new Swing King Bat Project. Hi, I'm Angel Lovano, and I will be talking to you guys about the new Swing King Bat Project. This is relevant to you because you have invested a lot of money into this project and are looking for a higher return than what you have invested. I have been put in charge of this because I've been working on bats for this company for the past six years. For this briefing, I will be showing you guys the Swing King Bat Project as well as some problems that we had while creating the bats and the solutions that we had towards the end. Towards the end of this briefing, I will be talking to you guys about a recap and answering any questions that you guys might have. Now, without further ado, let's dive into the project and what it's about. Our goal is to make a wood baseball bat that are 100% wood and not break no matter where you hit the ball. This is also a bat that would be able to be legal at any level of play, from high school all the way to the professional level. This was an important project because more and more people are beginning to use wood bats throughout the world. Luckily, this project was possible by finding the most durable wood to use, which is the combination of bamboo and maple. In the following section, I'll be showing you some key challenges that we went through. The wood bats after a few weeks will begin to start molding and breaking down if you weren't using them as often. The lack of usage on these bats would cause them to break down, mold, and even not be usable at times. As a result, the bats were unusable, and when someone would try and use them, they wouldn't be able to gain the same results that they had once they first got the bat. This was a big problem for the situation that we were going through. Now, this doesn't sound too good, but we worked on it and we f have figured out a solution that will keep the bat at its highest potential for as long as possible. The first thing that we had done was went through all of our draft bats and found which ones uh, had the best uh, form of staying this, staying intact and not molding throughout staying, uh, staying still for long periods of time. We tried bats with more maple than bamboo, as well as more bats with more bamboo than maple and different types of combinations like that. After figuring out which one not mold, we just began to make all of our bats based on that sort of material, which we found best being used more bamboo than maple, which caused them to stay firm and not mold. So to conclude this briefing, I have to talk about the Swing King Bats project, the problems that we had, and the actions that we took to fix these problems. To summarize, our project is to make 100% wood bats that would not break. However, because of certain amounts of wood and to, on certain amount of the bat, where it caused it to mold and we had to uh, go over the bats. And luckily, after going over all of our drafts, we figured out that the exact amount of each wood that should be going into the bats to make it usable for as long as possible. With that, I am happy to say that we have found the best bat possible for you. Thank you.